Hey guys, Max Katz here with Outpre.io. In this video, I'm going to show you how to build a mobile app connected to a relational database in about five minutes. So to start, we need to expose the relational database via a REST API. And I have a database here. Now my database is running on Amazon, um, but of course you can connect to your database. And we can look quickly at the database. So this is an example um, where employees enter expense reports. Um, and that information is saved into a relational database and you would like to build an app, a mobile app, that where you can review those reports. So just pretty simple, just uh, one table with some names. Now, the first thing we need to do is we need to connect to the database from appre.io. And we're going to use API Express feature. So we're going to create a new connection. We'll call my database. Select a database type. Now the host, and we don't need, and then the uh, port 5432. 5432. Now database name is demo db, and then the username and the password. All right. Now we can save, and we can instantly test. All right. So test successful. So we connected to the database that's running on Amazon. Let's go back, and now we're going to create a project. Now the project will expose the database via REST APIs. So first we create a connection, and then a project, and we call this expanse report API. Let's open it, and um, here we can create services, and we're going to do it automatically via a new model. And we'll just call this expanses and select the connection. Now we select the table, there's only one, and we're going to generate all these services. All right, so all these services were automatically generated and we can test the service. All right, so for example, find, um, now we can get all of them. So we're going to remove this, scroll down to test, and you can see we instantly get uh, the data, right? So we're invoking a REST service that connects to the relational database. So this is good. We're going to copy this URL. Right? And we're going to go to the app. So the database uh, connection is done. We got a REST service and it's working. Let's go to the apps tab and we'll create a new app. Expenses app and click create. Right, and we already have a page in the app. We'll just call this app, and we'll drag and drop a list. Now, because we're going to be getting the data, we just need one item, and then we're going to go and create a service and paste the uh, URL. Now, the only thing is for the where uh, we need to put because we're getting all all the values uh, an empty J. Um, is going to be empty. All right, and now we can go to test, click test and test the service. All right, so it works. We're going to create the response when we're done with the service. Let's go to the UI. We're going to go to data, service. All right, nothing for the input, so just for the mapping for the output. And then this is the collection of all the expense reports, and this is the name. Save. The last thing is to invoke the service, so we select the page. And we're going to use page show, invoke service, all right, and we're ready to test. All right, and here we go, we get the list. So you can see how simple it is. Again, we connected to a relational database, we created APIs, and then built a mobile app with those uh, APIs. So again, definitely give this a try. Um, sign up for an Outpredator Startup plan and try API Express. Thanks for watching.